All right, can anybody tell me what a serve is? A serve is what puts the ball in place it's the first hit. There are four types of serves. Can anybody tell me one of them? Go ahead. Underhand serve. Underhand serve, okay. How does an underhand serve work? You swing your arm like a pendulum and you're gonna hit the ball out of your arm like this. Okay, can anybody tell me another type of serve? An overhand serve. Overhand serve, that's right. It's kind of like you are spiking earlier, only you're going to aim a little bit higher because you're going to have to hit the ball over the net. So you're going to toss the ball up and hit it like a spike. Can anybody tell me another type of serve? A jump serve. Jump serve, right. A jump serve is a lot like a spike too. Only this time, you're going to toss the ball really high, you're going to take an approach and then swing through the ball just like you were spiking. Can anybody tell me the final type of serve? Skyball. That's right. What's a skyball for? It confuses people. And how does it confuse people? They have to look up and they see the sun and the clouds and everything, it distracts them. There's wind and there's sun, right? Clouds. Okay. A skyball is a lot like an underhand serve, only you're going to drive the ball way up in the air, drive it higher. So you're going to hold it like you do for an underhand serve, and you're going to get under the ball and hit it way up in the air. Consistent speed backwards and forwards works best. A small step forward may be added with the leading foot to increase forward momentum. The ball can be hit out of the palm of the hand or with a very slight toss. As your player's proficiency increases, move them back incrementally until they are at the court's end line. You may not get children in the youngest age division all the way back, but that's okay because USYBL rules will allow eight to 10 year olds to serve from inside the inline if needed. The overhand serve utilizes many of the same mechanics as spiking. For this drill, players will start about 10 feet from the net too. The jump serve incorporates an approach like the one used for spiking and a high toss. A high toss is key. This serve can take time to master, but be patient. 